What's up, Resto Mods? Chris here, here to talk to you a little bit about transmissions. Right here on the right, you can see this is a Borg Warner T5. This is a transmission that was in RM5, which was Auto Stifle, was the winner of RM5. It's a Factory 5 Cobra with a 427 engine in it. And we were actually at a local Southern California cruise sponsored by POL when we saw him pulled over on the side of the road. So naturally we stopped, to see what was going on in this Cobra and it had eaten up this transmission. This poor little Borg Warner T5 just couldn't handle it anymore. And luckily we were around. We got him back safely home and we decided it's time to upgrade. Time to go to something really serious for him. So SST really stepped it up and we're going with this TKO 500. These T5s were originally in like Fox body Mustangs and you can see they're just not designed to take the kind of power that a 427 has. Uh, I think the original Fox body Mustang was in the low 200 horsepower range and that's kind of what these transmissions were designed to hold. You see them a lot in uh, resto mod applications, but this one just didn't hold up to that kind of power. So fortunately we have a great sponsor, SST Silver Sport Transmissions, stepped up to the plate and provided this TKO 500. Just head and shoulders better transmission than this, no doubt. They provided a comprehensive kit uh, that includes the bell housing, some hardware, your installation manual, very thorough installation manual, may I add. They hooked it up with their STX shifter. Uh, this thing is gonna handle the power, no problem. It's gonna be a huge upgrade for auto driving that Cobra. And it doesn't get much better than this transmission. SST, great company to work for. We had them actually in RM11, which was our Corvette. That had a SST transmission. And you're also gonna see a SST transmission in RM13, which is our Dodge Charger. Some of you have been lucky enough to work on a factory five car, and you know how fun it is to get a transmission out of one of them. There's a couple different ways to do it. We decided to pull the engine and trans out as one unit. Uh, it was just easier for us. Some guys are able to do it in car, but we wanted to pull it out. We got to do uh, some tricks for the reinstall anyway. We're going to line up the new bell housing and get everything dialed, and it's just easier to do outside of the car. But we had a lot of fun taking this one out. Factory 5 cars are almost a mid-engine car, so the transmission's way back there. But we got it out, and we're ready to put this badass new transmission in. There's a lot of small and big differences between the T5 and the TKO 500. Uh, right off the bat, you can see size-wise, this thing's a lot beefier. And there's a ton of technical things inside here that just make it way stronger and way better than this and more reliable. For more tech specs, check out SST Silver Sport Transmissions. They have applications for almost every type of classic car that you can think of, and those guys are great. They'll get you exactly what you need and get you on the road. So now all we got left to do is throw this thing in. We're gonna go ahead and install it in the Cobra and uh, take it out for a little ride and take you guys along. So I'm here with Otto. He's the winner of, I want to say RM5? Five. RM5, five. this uh, 1965? Five. 1965. Factory 5, third gen Cobra, 427 Cobra. The Roadster. The Roadster. Uh, and you won that car from us. How long ago was that? It was two, like yesterday. Almost two years. Two years. It'd be two years in June. When we were doing this car, uh, the transmission worked great, but it was a T5, and so it's kind of a known issue. The T5 is not the strongest transmission, and with an engine with this much torque, uh, either the tires break loose or the gears break loose, and eventually, I guess, the gears break loose. Gears broke loose. So, our good buddies over at Silver Sport Transmissions were nice enough to give us a T56, which we dropped in here, which is much stronger. Uh, I've actually test drove it a couple times, and it is a blast, and feels super solid, and uh, I hope this is going to last you for years to come. So, thank you. big thank you to the guys at Silver Sport Transmissions. Uh, a big thank you to our in-house mechanic, Chris, who uh, put this whole thing together. So what do you think? Should we take it for a ride? I think we better. It's sunny. Let's, Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> Feels like you remember? 
Oh yeah. I'm Otto, I'm the RM5 winner of the Factory 5 Cobra. I want to thank Silver Sport Transmissions and the Restomod guys. Best guys you'll ever meet. You're welcome, dude. Thank you. Thank you.